With so many manufacturers making capped composite decking and maintenance-free decking, how do we know which one is best? How do you know which one will be the right fit for your home? We have Trex and Timbertech, Azek, Knotwood, Wolf Decking. There are so many, literally dozens of manufacturers making maintenance-free decking. Why? do we lean towards Trex? Why is Trex one of the best manufacturers of composite decking? We're gonna dive into that right now in this video. One of the reasons we like Trex so much, and it's a reason that doesn't get a ton of media coverage, is that 95% of a Trex board is recycled material. The wood is recycled hardwood from flooring and furniture manufacturers. The plastic is recycled plastic, much of it from poly wrap on pallets or plastic shopping bags. A 16 foot Trex board contains just over 2,200 recycled plastic bags, which means a 500 square foot deck has about 140,000 recycled shopping bags in it. We think that's pretty cool, Trex being one of the largest recyclers of plastic bags and reusing that material for decking material for your home. Trex is a composite board, a capped composite board, which means the core of the board itself is that composite material, the recycled plastic and recycled hardwood. The cap stack on top is that polymer that protects the board, that gives your board color and grain. The cap is capped on a Trex core board on three sides. You have the top and the two sides. It's open on the bottom, which allows any water vapor during the manufacturing process to escape. Any water vapor that gets back into the decking board somehow, in some way, has a space to escape. Rather than how some manufacturers cap their composite boards on all four sides, in theory, trapping any moisture that may be in there. Trex allows that moisture to escape through its bottom uncapped side. The cap of the Trex board, again, the part that you see and stand on, the part that gives your board the color and grain pattern, that cap is actually manufactured and applied to the core congruently, which means as the board is extruded and manufactured, that cap gets applied at the same time. That cap becomes part of the board. Some manufacturers, they extrude the core, ship off the core to another facility where they then apply the cap. And unfortunately, we have seen instances where that cap, if you were able to pry something underneath that cap, the cap become separated from the core. Not with Trex. With Trex, if you were to somehow pry something between the cap and the core, that cap would come off with chunks of the core. Like a turtle shell. If you rip off the shell of a turtle, a bit gross, chunks of that turtle would come with it. That cap is now part of the core of the board. Trex also performs an extensive amount of in-house testing for every batch of Trex boards that get manufactured. They perform UV testing to make sure the boards will stand up to the sun. They perform heat testing and scratch testing and pressure testing. All of these tests ensure that every Trex board comes out meeting the specs of the manufacturer and will stand up to time to ensure your deck lasts for decades. Another thing that in our personal experience that we like about Trex is, is that Trex actually stands behind any claims that are thrown at them. In the current warranty, Trex stands behind their boards for 25 years. They're stating that for 25 years, their board will not fade from the sun or stain. Now, while we have not been a part of a ton of claims, the one or two that we have been a part of, Trex has absolutely stood behind those claims, helped us out, helped the homeowner out to make sure that that homeowner was taken care of. For those interested, that claim was the top of a Trex railing that the metal started to peel away. Extremely rare, does not happen often at all, but Trex was there took care of it, took care of the homeowner, and we replaced that at no charge to the homeowner. 
And finally, one of the things we like most about Trex is that because it is a capped composite board with a polymer cap, there is no chemical reaction as some other PVC manufactured boards have. PVC, for example, just from the nature of PVC has a chemical reaction between PVC, rubber, and water. For example, on your outdoor deck, you put a rubber mat on your PVC deck, there's gonna be a chemical reaction between that rubber, water, and PVC. You might notice some hazing, some gray hazing underneath that mat if you were to move it. With Trex, there is no concern about chemical reaction with the heavy hitters such as vinegar, ketchup, mustard, rubber from a rubber mat, or even when you're spraying sunscreen spray on yourself, there's no chemical reaction, again, like some other composite board manufacturers have to deal with. On top of that, one of the biggest benefits of Trex, at least here in the Southeast Michigan area, is because it's so popular, so many lumber yards stock Trex, which means it's gonna be one of the most cost competitive options out there versus a lot of other brands are special order and may be more expensive than a Trex board. To sum it all up, with Trex standing behind their board, manufacturing a great product from 95% recycled material, a board that is maintenance free and that will last for decades, beautiful color, beautiful grain pattern, very competitively priced, are just some of the reasons why we love Trex and stand behind Trex as a great board to install for your deck. As always, feel free to reach out to Custom Deck Creations or your local deck builder with any questions.